Hi, it's Jill with Crick Flex. And I give you, I'll give you a little bit of a heads up. The stuff that I'm kind of filming now is not really, it's already pretty much done, but I'm hoping that my memory <laughs> flows with me here to try and, I'm gonna finish up these trolls and do the bases and kind of just give you an idea. Um, one of the reasons I haven't been filming a whole lot lately not just because i was on vacation but um there are other reasons too and it's the changes some of the changes that are going on with the shop i'm working on the trolls centerpieces right now and i know branch's name and i know poppy's name and the other ones are written on the order and somebody once told me i shouldn't be filming if i don't know their name as well I hate to tell you, but any one of us are not going to know everything, and I will be the first to admit it. I've got little chunks of wood that I had picked up, I believe it was at Michael's. If it doesn't have a name on it. And they're just little chunks of wood, and anybody would say, why would you buy those? Because I can make them. These particularly, but you know what, sometimes we pay for convenience, and they were on sale, so I bought them. And what I'd like to do is just add, these are just all different kinds of pieces of trunk. I also have some bark, but I'm saving the bark because I'm going to be doing Moana. And I want to make Fahiti, Fatiti, whatever her name is, the mountainside. I'm going to do her and I'm going to put boss and I'm going to put bark in it. So I'm excited about that one. Um, for right now, I'm just finishing these boxes. I'm going with the 6x6x6 six 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 box lid. This one is going to be for Poppy, who's got a little purple and blue in her. The purple glitter is already on there. My box is attached. My hole is drilled. Everything is good, so I'm just going to put the sides on it. I'm going to get them all in their bases first before I move on to step two. Legs are real easy to, to use as my braces for these things when I'm putting them together. Um, our weather is improving gradually day by day and kids are having a blast. It's it's so fun to watch the grandkids when the weather starts getting nice because they hit their feet hit the pavement when they get out of bed in the morning. They're just so excited. And for Christmas, my one daughter's kids got a motorcycle. I think I told this yesterday. Well, the minute they get up in the morning, they're wanting to know if they can get a ride. They can't drive it because they're too they're too little. Only Brady. Brady's at school. So they asked mommy and mommy is kind as she is, gets up and even though it's 27 degrees out, it's a heat wave here, she gets all ready and she takes them out. Takes particularly uh, Wyatt and Blake out for a spin on um, her motorcycle. And they love it. Yesterday was just too funny though because Blake wanted to go again. He doesn't, he's only a year and a half old and he doesn't like to take turns. So when he had to get off the bike, he wasn't getting off. And Wyatt was getting on, whether he got off or not. So mommy picked him up and set him down on the ground because his turn was over. It was the other one's turn. And he laid on the ground. Um, he was not happy. So he laid face down on the ground. Um, whining. It was just, oh, you know, I said, that kid is so cute. I would give him anything he he wanted just because he's so stinking cute. But he's so, he's a drama queen. My gosh. You'd think somebody was pulling his legs off. He laid there just mad because he, I don't think he believes he has to share turns. Of course, he's going to learn that along the roads. Now, I'm going to take the pink base. These are the ones that have the chunk of wood that my husband cuts up to put in the bottom. These are the lids off of my 6x6x6 six six six, um, boxes that I buy at Uline. And if you type in 6x6x6 six 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 boxes, these will come up. There's two different kinds. There's one that you can get 4x4x4, 5x5x5, and 6x6x6, but they have a lid that is attached, um, like gift boxes that you get for let's say a coffee mug it's all in one um i just ordered some of those like those came in today and i may open those and take a look at them how i'm going to be using them but i use these because when i do the box bases that have the shredded paper or the um crepe paper any kind of paper that i have in it and, and put the base in it and then the salutation on the box 
I don't use the lid. So I have all the lids left over. Well, now they found use for the lids. <laughs> I don't have enough lids. So um, my husband's been very, very, very creative with things that we have around here, like coconut shells on yesterday's video. And um, I've got my tape's not coming off. Um, looking at my closet because there's different things that I have that I'm going to be using as bases. I'm going to try and get away from a lot of the wood bases and the reason being is I want to come up with something much more unique and uh, I just want something more unique and I cannot believe how many pop-ups I get or whatever um, with the, the center pieces now and it's um, the wood base, the, the peg, I mean, not even a little bit of diversion of the centerpiece itself, but, so I'm going to be heading down a different trail, guys, and that, a lot of that stuff is going to be filmed after it is done, not, for pictures, it's not going to be filmed at all, it's going to just have pictures. I don't know what our films going down the road are going to be, but some of the stuff I've done, I just haven't showed how I did it. Okay, I've got that one. Let me see what I'm going to do with the next one. I have no idea how I'm going to put the wood on them. And her, she had blue on, and actually this one was for her. Wrong one. I guess it really doesn't matter, but she had the blue and the purple on. So I'm going to put her on that. And I'm going to put Poppy on the pink and the teal. These things are so cute. I do have the pink, the hot pink for the hair for Poppy, but this person did not want the hair done. So, I didn't. I do sometimes follow directions. There we go, got that, I want to firm. Sometimes when you're putting the feet on and you're putting your peg in, the feet can have a tendency to not be flat enough. The best bet to do with that is to cut it off so that you can get this down further into your base because the further down in the base it is the better and that was not going to go all the way down so let me see how am I going to do this one because I want her to go down I'm not sure but I'm going to come up with something here and it's going to entail shortening that we'll see might not have to do anything okay now the blue one I did this little guy on and then I did the Happy Branch, which is a different color. And I learned this yesterday because my daughter kept saying she couldn't find a Happy Branch that was good enough resolution. And I'm like, what the heck is a Happy Branch? And then she said he changes colors. So we did find one of the right solution or resolution. I've got these, these pieces of wood that are attached to the felt. I'm going to add those on to, I think I'm going to add those to this guy. And not many. I'm not going to do the whole thing. I think I'm just going to put a couple. I don't want to cover the whole box. I just want a little bit on there. Just to give it a little something different. So I'm going to take my hot glue gun and I am going to I have to take you off for a minute, Branch, and figure out how I'm going to do this box. Hot glue it to the side of the box. And I use multiple colors of, of the um, glitter paper because I have, when I cut the pieces to make the lids here, um, I have left, I mean, I, I use one on each lid and then a, a one of the six by six on two lids, and then I have two six by six left, so I cut those in four in the strips and I use those for the strips to go around the box. That's how come they, I end up with all of those. And I probably just said something that made absolutely no sense. That's okay, that's okay. And we're gonna try a few of these little, let's see what I got here going on. Oh, and I got some big ones over here. I just want to make these different. And I suppose I could grab some rocks too, guys. And I'm going to. I'm going to grab some rocks. I'm going to grab some natural things 
to this. Now this is not opened. So let me see what the trick to this is. Okay, open it that way. I'm trying to see how I can make sure I can reclose re it. I think I gotta figure it out. I think I know, I think I know. I'm gonna use one of the bigger ones. My husband's gonna yell at me because, and I'm gonna have it a little bit off the box. Again, oh, I just tried to catch that after dropping it and it wasn't anywhere near. Need to learn not to do that. Is that how it works? Got those branches in the front. I'm going to put a couple branches, however, on the base. Again, this is just simply for adding some other elements to the pieces and giving them a little bit more dimension. It just looks like somebody's been out there. You can hear my mom. My mom's been having a really rough time, guys. And it's getting rough on me because I can't figure out what the issue is. She's in there. We just had dinner. I made dinner. And she's in there doing dishes. And the doctor had recommended that she do something to keep herself busy. So that's what she's doing. But she was upset at the dinner table and crying. And I'm trying to find out why, and she won't tell me. And then I feel, of course, that I've done something, and she's assured me that it's not anything. It's something of her own regrets or doings or whatever. And I, it's hard, guys. It's hard. Hard, hard, hard. I just... Constantly and second guessing if I did the right thing. You know, it's. I hear a lot of people say, oh, you know, you're so blessed. And I think, oh, then why don't I feel like just sometimes it's so hard. And I guess it's because I'm still so active. And I don't want any of that to change. I don't want to change me. Guys, I feel stuck. There we go. That wasn't a whining, guys. That's just, I'm sure that anybody who has done what I'm doing completely understands where I'm coming from. It's hard. But, okay, there's the base for a ranch. And I will take pictures when I'm all done. And come on, branch, stand down in there. There you go. Okay, what am I going to do with him? What am I going to do on him? I think I'm going to do some rocks. Put some little stones on his. Mm -hmm. Let me take him off. And I'm going to do some stones up on here. Just with random, total randomness here. What am I thinking of that I want? What's it say? All these natural elements that, because the guy's name is Branch, and he's wood, or this his thing is, his little vest is leaves, and his pants look like they're, they're made of um, bark or something. I'm assuming that's why he's called Branch. I've never seen the show. And no, I'm not going to watch the show. I have too much to do. People can tell me what they want. And so far, I figured it out. Let's see, what do we have on a positive note, guys? What do I have? I don't know. I don't know if I have anything. Got a new grandchild coming in three weeks. Hoping for a little girl. I want what I want and I'll love what I get, but I really am hoping for a little girl. Jen is very, 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 what's the word I want to use? Very into girly things. Um, and I know that if she had a girl, 
and the girl had curly hair like Blake has, I know that I'd have a granddaughter that would be running around with curly pigtails or something. <laughs> as dumb as that is, I love curly hair on, curly hair on kids and little girls. Little boys too. Lane has got super curly hair. And I want her to have a little girl with Lane's hair. But when it all said and done, I just want the baby to be healthy. But we would all be lying if we didn't say that there were things that you might think you'd love to have. We want what we want and we love what we get. Doesn't matter. I've got two and two. Wouldn't trade them for anything. I just want a curly hair granddaughter. Charlie's got curly hair. And Wyatt had curly hair or has curly hair, but his father shaves it all off. I've lost his curls after his father started taking him in for haircuts. And I knew that was coming. Did I know that was coming? Yes. Oh, see, I like that. And I picked the blue um, for the glitter on this because it went oh, so well with him. And I like that. And some strings off. There we go. Number three. What should I put on her? Looking to see if I have anything else that's jumping out at me. That's screaming, put me on. And I'm not. So. What should I put on here? Should have thought about that before I sat down here to film, shouldn't I? Well, I didn't. So, I know what I'm going to go with. I see something here I want. So, I'm going to grab it and hopefully not knock the camera over. We're going to go with one of these. Yep, I got it. Real simple one. I'm going to just use one of these little doojabbies. And I need my cutter. I had to get a new wire cutter. Everybody always asks me what cutter do I use, and I send them to my hearts. And I don't use that one anymore. I've worn it out. So the one I use now is, I don't think it's even from Nards. Oh, I ordered it off of Amazon because my daughter had one, and I was jealous. So I went and ordered one. And <laughs> obviously it's not working real good for me. I should just go take hers because I could have sworn it was easy. Ooh. Well, at least it didn't land nose down. I dropped scissors on the floor that had landed nose down and and ended up driven into my hood floors. Not good. How do I want to do these? I think I know. I think I got it. I'm going to stand these up. This this little floral here. And I know it's not going to stand up and stay. So I am going to take some wood chunks and build it around for support. Poke my eye out with wood stick, or a glue stick. I just ordered glue sticks yesterday, and I ordered boxes, and I ordered glitter, and glitter paper, and 12 by 18 inch paper, and it's starting to come in, but I don't want to put it away because I want my daughters to come over and take what they need. When I stock up, I order in bulk, so my living room's got all these huge boxes in there, and I need to have them take them out, get them out of there, because I want them out of my living room. And my husband is just happily creating. He's finished the table now on the armoire that I was talking about yesterday, the armoire that he took apart, took the drawers out, took the doors off, took the shelves off, and all of those pieces that he's taken apart have been um, used to make other pieces. So he just finished a little desk today that I think we're, we're going to be doing stenciling on, or vinyl, whatever. Um, he's he's going to end up with five pieces of furniture out of that armoire. And he's loving it. Let's see. I really like that on there. Really like that a lot. She's got that cotton hair. 
this poofy cotton yarn and all that so you know what I'm going to use on her and I don't want to get right in front and I probably already did I'm going to use these on her they match her earmuffs and we'll use little cotton pieces of cotton because these would go really cute with her headpiece and her hair that, that. oh poke my eye out I'm gonna hurt myself seriously now let me see how I'm gonna lay it I'm gonna bend this and lay it down so one piece is down one piece is up I think we're all good and there we go and ouch one burn down okay let me use a thicker piece right in here now, I will have to take a picture and send them to the person that these are going to so that she knows which base goes on which one and how they should go. Not that it's going to take a rocket scientist to figure it out, but I'm going to send it to her anyway. And I'm going to add a couple of these chunks. I picked the wood again because the theme is the trolls and I believe they live outside in the woods or in I don't know somebody gonna tell me why I have to watch the movie and that happened so do the best I can okay I'm done with that what I'm gonna do is go ahead and take some pictures I'm gonna try and get some scrapbooking done because I, I've got quite a bit um, I've got all my Disney trip that I need to get filmed and scrapbooked some of the stuff that I have that's more recent and I'm going to see if I can get this closed the way that it was with this little tiny cute little thing here what do you think the chances are I'm thinking not very good let me see now I think it went I think I know it went through here and Fold it in half, and this went over it, and clicked down on top of it, and I did it, but this thing is broken. <laughs> oh, well, thank you guys for watching, and I'll be back um, oh, scrapbooking next. Thanks a lot. Have a good night. Bye-bye.